your blood glucose is going to be lower. So it literally drops to the floor. Some people that do like carnivore, especially carnivore, not so much keto, because keto requires actually lower protein. But a lot of people that are eating a lot of protein and saturated fat, their blood glucose levels can be oftentimes higher than people on the standard American diet. That's exactly right. They skyrocket because of gluconeogenesis. They're making protein from the fat, you know. And, and people that are consuming carbohydrates regularly, their body has already trained that. And that was my point earlier about talking about Ben Patrick, you know, talking about training right. the shins and all these different right. things. We have forgotten that you can train the metabolism. So it sounds reckless to go and jump into a bunch of candy and a bunch of sugar and, and these different things that we're potentially proposing here, but it's really not, nearly not as reckless as you might think. And that's why Joe Rogan and Andrew Huberman, Tom Segura, and all the people that I've known uh, for the last couple of years and gotten to be close with, it's the reason why they're hitting me up, asking me like, hey, what what's going on here? And yeah. bodybuilders, like high yeah. level bodybuilders, Bodybuilders are talking about, hey, maybe I could utilize a little bit in prep. Like that's not heard of. Bodybuilders never adopt anything new in prep except for drugs. Yeah, <laughs> they, right. They're not going to change their fucking diet though, that because their career is on the line.